Hello there, here we are in the uh, beautiful region of Puglia. Now today I'm showing you something incredibly special. We are located just outside of Ostuni, so we're just on the outskirts. So the beautiful thing about the property I'm showing you today, it's a villa, but it's literally kind of in town, right? So you can walk into town from this location. Ideal for anyone who's kind of not decided between if they want the countryside or if they want a town property, because this is that in between. Now there's 220 square meters of property that I'm showing you today. So it's a lot of property and it's divided up into three apartments that are separate from the main house. So you're seeing one just behind me here. There's another two below this, and then we have the main house. But let's start walking in the first main apartment here because I just want to show you the spectacular views as well. So you can see, this is a completely independent apartment from the main house. We have a little kitchenette area, and then we have a good sized bathroom with shower there as well. Coming through here, look at these gorgeous views. I mean, as I say, we don't often take on properties that are just outside of town. So I think this one's gonna be incredibly interesting. It also would work very well as a bed and breakfast because obviously we have a lot of bedrooms here. It's three apartments, so you've got three bedrooms in the apartments and then you've got another uh, bedroom or two which could be done in the main house. So come on with me outside. I just want to show you this roof terrace here, which is the terrace to the downstairs veranda. We've got a little barbecue area here and an outside sink, but look at these gorgeous views. Now, you can't really see Ostuni from this location, but I will insert the drone video to give you an idea of exactly where we are because it's one of the key points of this property. You have 2,000 square meters of garden, which is all below us. But look how you can see all the way down to Torre Carne. You've got the sea views, the hillside views, and these views carry out with all the apartments and the actual main house also has these views. So it's a really spectacular property today that I'm showing you. Again, there is a lot of property to show you. So come with me back through. Again, good size room. We've got lots of light in here. There's a nice breeze coming through as well. But I love that again, that you're literally in town but you've also got this beautiful country home and you can see these stairs the the owners of this property have put so much love into it you've got all these plants and cacti i think some of the species that i'm seeing here i've never seen before coming down here is the central part of the property and this we've got this beautiful again another beautiful outside veranda but look at those views, they carry on even at this level, even if we walked down, because we're on a hillside, you can still see those stunning sea views. And again, you can also see the top of the trees. Let's go into apartment number two, and then we'll pass over on the other side to the main house. So again, you've got a really nice outside area. Each one has its own independent outside area. You've got the outside table, good sitting area, little barbecue area out here, of course. And then coming into the apartment, you can see we've got this really good sized kitchen, actually. I mean, just for a secondary apartment, this is really nice to see that you've got such a good sized kitchen. And then behind here, we've got another bedroom and we've got the bathroom set up. Lots of storage at the back here, and then you can show them quickly the ensuite bathroom, which is fully kitted out and obviously has the shower, sink, bidet, and all the usual stuff that you get in bathrooms. So really nice sliding door here, good size room. You've got the window out here. We haven't opened all the curtains because it's unnecessary. We've got air conditioning, something I haven't mentioned. We have air conditioning in all these apartments as well as the main house. So another really nice plus point. I do want to show you the sea view even from this apartment and you can see that snippet through the trees. It's absolutely beautiful. Now let's pass over to the other side. There is another apartment down below, but I'll leave that until last. We'll go around the garden area. So here we're going into the main part of the property and we've got the sitting room, but we do actually have an entrance 
to another apartment round the back here. So this has in its own independent entrance and be com can be completely separated from the main house. You've got again another outside area. So really it's four apartments plus a main house. So we'll go in through the main entrance and you can see here just how stunning this property is. Now again, I can't stress how rare it is to come by a property which is literally just outside of Ostuni and it's more like having a townhouse but with a garden and everything that you could want from a country home. So you can see this beautiful window is really what captures the attention. Look at the views of the sea from here. You've got all the olive trees and obviously uh, those hills, again, we're on a hillside here, so we are looking down. And this is a huge sitting room. In total, as I said previously, we are looking at 220 square meters of property today, a lot of property. This is also lived in all year round, so it does have uh, all the connections to the mains water supply. It has the connections to the gas for heating, and they've also got a fireplace that also connects up to the radiators in the house as well. So you can see the radiators, these large gold radiators on the walls here. So again, I can't stress how large this room is. It's absolutely beautiful. And we've got lots of light coming in here. So coming through here, I'm gonna take you to the first bedroom in this part of the property. So if you come on through here, you can see even this section here, it's almost like it's its own independent apartment as well because it's kind of divided up from that main area. Here we've got the bedroom and we've got again those beautiful sea views and this means you're waking up and seeing the sea views. Again this property could work really well if you're looking for a property for yourself and then you'd like to have guests over or potentially if you would like to rent it out. So the current owners do rent the apartments out and they live in the main apartment as you can see this is a lived in property. We've got another bathroom in here that you can see is a very good size and again lots of lights coming in. We've got lots of wind going through this property so it's a, a nice and breezy in here uh, and that's because we've got windows on all the sides of the property. So I'm going to show you this. Now it is very packed this room here and it's more of a walk-in walk closet than anything else. I can't actually find the light here. Hang on a second just here we go. So you can see this is a walk-in closet and they do have a lot of clothes, but this is actually a really large room in itself. So it's good to see that you've got plenty of uh, space. If you have a lot of clothes, you're not gonna have problems here. Again, what I was mentioning previously is that you know by closing this door, this almost becomes another independent apartment, right? So that's another thing which could be of interest to you. Now coming through here, I do want to show you this door. What a beautiful door this is. So this is an antique door uh, which they had added to the property. And we can see here, coming through here, I mentioned it previously uh, from the outside. Now the owner of this property, she is a tailor, as you can see, she makes clothes. So this is her workshop and that is why we're seeing it so jam full of stuff. So obviously you kind of have to use your imagination here in this section, but this is where we have, again, it's a, another apartment. You have an independent entrance, which is what I mentioned previously. And then at the back here, we have a bathroom. Now it's not accessible now because I can see just how much stuff is in there, but you do have a bathroom. This could potentially be another bedroom very easily and I think obviously the size it doesn't come across because she's got so many of these storage and and these are actually going back quite deep so it, it is a good size uh, living room for someone who wanted again another apartment so coming through here we're coming through to the kitchen now I'm a huge fan of this kitchen a because I think they've done it in the position where it's on the other side of the house so it's very separate from all the other apartments in the house. But look how beautiful it's been done. They haven't spared any expense with this kitchen. And again, even from the kitchen window, yes, you guessed it, we've still got those sea views and they are looking beautiful again from every room in the house. Now here we've got a fully functional fireplace. We've got 
a dispensary for food here. So we actually just have a little bit more storage space here. And I'm just seeing if I can find the uh, switch here, but maybe you can just have a look without the lights. And then on the other side of the fireplace, we have another bathroom. So really good, lots of bathrooms in this property, uh, good size prop, uh, bathrooms as well. Here, we've got a bit of storage space as well. So tons of storage space in this property. And I think that's, you know, again, a massive plus point, but really cute kitchen here. And again, really good size. We've got the air conditioning unit as well. So it is all very cool in this property. And this leads me outside to yet another veranda. I mean, this is really a property that just keeps on giving you more property. So here we have an outside space. We've got a completely fully functional outside kitchen here uh, as well. So you've got the sink, you've got the uh, hobs here, um, and that is incredible to have. So it's a completely fully functional. I think here we have, uh, that's the piaster as well. So you can also do your heat. So really fully functional kitchen. They've got drawers, they've got a fridge. And I love how you can kind of tell they've done even the fridge in the same style as the rest of it to integrate it into the kitchen. So I love these little details with the tiles. I mean, this again is a property that has been thought out with love. This garden here is absolutely stunning. I absolutely love this. And this wall is not where the property finishes because there is a driveway where I'll show you in a bit where you can drive the car down. Obviously that is part of the property even beyond this. So we have that as well. And you've got that really sought after off street parking, right? If a lot of you people you know, I have a tendency to criticize living in town because often it can be problematic parking wise, especially if you're gonna be coming in the summertime. So I love this garden. Again, I can't stress enough how pretty it is. Uh, we also have the pizza oven, which I didn't even mention. And this again is a really good space. They've actually opened up this window section here to continue with those sea views, which is really something I love. They've really managed to make the most out of those beautiful views. Here we've got more outside space, more hose pipes, sinks. We've got water everywhere around this property. And then here we have yet another separate situation going on with another room which again is being used as a workstation for the current owner and you can see even back here we've got yet more storage space so you've got a little bit of storage space in here as well and uh, potentially you know this could also be another really useful room depending on uh, what you would need now underneath the house we have storage as well more storage which is uh Obviously, always a good thing to have more storage in these properties. So you can see this runs all the way underneath the house and uh, you get the idea in terms of how much storage space we have here. But also, just round here, we've got the entrance to the property, which is the other side from, so we entered from one of the sides and that's really the small gate where you enter via foot. Here, we've got the driveway. So this, you literally call up, drive up, drive in. We've even got an outside shower on this roof terrace here, which is a nice sun lounge area. Now, please turn around and show them the view because it keeps changing as we move around the house and it keeps, you see different angles. This is so open and really the house is incredibly strategically placed. Uh, and I can't stress enough how close to Ostuni we are, but I'll be, better be able to show you that with the drone video, which I will be running throughout this video. So coming down, now it's time for me to show you the garden. We also have that final apartment to show you, which arguably for me is one of the nicest because it's more of the old style apartments uh, that you usually get and you're usually used to seeing. So we've got a little parking area here. Now we have spoken to our technical who's also allowed us to uh, understand that potentially here we can put 
a what they call a seasonal pool can be placed here now they make them incredibly nice so they are actually they look like they're fixed pools but there's a few options that you can have so there's no current currently no pool but it could be an option uh, to put one in and then coming down here we have the another beautiful sun lounge area which also extends onto a jacuzzi so we've got a jacuzzi here fully functional jacuzzi and that jacuzzi actually has sea views from inside the jacuzzi as well now look at this it's full of beautiful outside sitting areas this is a really good sized garden without being extremely too big i love the prickly pears in the background it just really creates for such a beautiful view and you can kind of see snippets in between the sea uh, of the sea in, in between the uh, prickly pears here so we've got the jacuzzi now if you follow me up here I do want to show you it, it is in function at the moment, but more than anything, I really want to show you the views that you get from here as well. So absolutely beautiful to see the jacuzzi. And if you turn around, they can see just what you can see from within the jacuzzi itself. So really nice thing to have on top of everything else that we already have here. And then coming round here, I just want to quickly show you we have a little outside kitchen. So you've got a very cute outside kitchenette, uh, which is, you've got the sink here, the outside fridge, uh, which is really useful to have, so you're not going back. We've got a little bit of a small bathroom there in the corner as well, so really cute to have for outside use. And coming back round, Yet another shower. Look at the other shower that we have. Now there's so much to say about this property. I'm always kind of looking around to see and they've nestled this in the natural rock of this area. So, I mean, it's absolutely beautiful as you can see. So really nice to be able to have that shower maybe before or after getting into the jacuzzi. Now we are walking back and we're walking back up to the property here. And this is the final apartment, which I've yet to show you. Now I've stressed out that each apartment has its own outside section. So this is the section dedicated to the below apartment. You've got this outside sitting area, really beautiful tree. I mean, look how stunning this tree is. It's really something that you need to see in person to fully appreciate. And the garden area itself, just show them the grass. It's really well taken care of this property and incredibly well thought out. So we've got the sink in the corner so again outside barbecue area dedicated to this apartment down below and i'm saying if it's a business that you're interested in doing where you're interested in renting out then this really is something which you should be considering let me just get the lights on in here if they are available to me yep so just show them here quickly we've got the outside uh, obviously, we've spoken about the outside kitchen. We've got the inside kitchen, decent sized kitchen, beautiful little bathroom. And then we've got the stone. Obviously, we couldn't finish on something better than this. We've got the stone bedroom, really cave-like feel in here. So it's almost kind of ticking all the boxes that you've also got the old style as well. You've got air conditioning, but this is arguably one of the coolest rooms because it's actually down below and obviously the walls are very thick as well. Fully functional kitchen here as well. And then coming back round, I do want to finish by showing you the rest of the garden area. Again, little sinks all over, scattered all over for the uh, watering of the plants. And you can see just how everything is in great condition. It's all been really well taken care of. I can't stress the amount of work that has been put into this property over the years. You can see this is a product of love and it's not something which has just been done just to make a quick buck. And that always shows in the difference. Look at these stone walls. You've got the little details here and the little uh, gaps where they've got vases. It's really, every time I've come here, I've noticed something new. And I just wanted to end with this view from the main part of the property. Again, I will be putting in the drone video. We are practically in Ostuni. You can walk to Ostuni from here. 
That is the important thing to this property. So if you have any more questions on this property or any of the others, please don't hesitate to get in touch. Thank you very much for watching.